What if you could learn anything you wanted just by typing text in a prompt? Well, you can, and you can do it with Chat GPT. Chat GPT. Chat GPT. So since its release, Chat GPT has been used for, well, pretty much anything you can imagine. But what really interests me is how can you use Chat GPT to, to learn stuff? And also, can Chat GPT make you a better learner? Okay, so I've been using ChatGPT for the last few weeks, and basically you can create your own bespoke courses with it. So let me show you what I mean. Just like that, it's created a really good 10-week course on Python. You could ask for the same thing on any subject that you're interested in. So now we have a course, but I want more than that. I want it to explain if statements to me. This topic is part of the course that it created, and so if you want it to expand on something, you just ask it to do that. It's done a good job with a clear explanation and example code. Now I want it to create a quiz based on the topics in week three. Quizzes are great for enhancing your learning and also finding those weak spots. ChatGPT can create a bespoke quiz on any topic at a difficulty level that you specify. A quiz, an actual quiz with multiple choice questions and answers. I also asked it for some project ideas, which were pretty good. And I asked it to tailor the courses for different pathways, so for web development or um, data science. But you don't have to just stick to coding, you could ask it for a course on Photoshop, or if you wanted to move away from software altogether, how about 19th century English literature? I picked this because it's a very different subject to the previous one, and I'd say this is a good introduction to 19th century English literature, covering Jane Austen, the Gothic tradition, romantic poets, and Charles Dickens. Now there's something else that it can do that I really want to show you. So this is a really good book on evidence-based learning techniques and I covered it on the channel a little while ago. So maybe you want to apply these methods to the courses that you've asked ChatGPT to create for you. Well, you don't have to read the book. You just ask ChatGPT to summarize it for you. And straight away, you get a summary of the main points of the book. Now you might need a study planner, you know, to plan your time for all of the courses that you've created. How on earth could you possibly do that? I'm sure you get the idea. And I'm not just gonna keep showing you more and more screenshots of ChatGPT. But I do want to give you a sense of what it's capable of. It can be your personal tutor and used correctly, it's a very powerful tool to help you streamline your learning and learn pretty much anything you want. It is important to remember that it's not perfect. Sometimes there are inaccuracies in what it tells you. Sometimes it's just completely wrong. Sometimes the code isn't optimized very well or just doesn't work. So you have to use it with caution. But in spite of that, I still think it's an incredibly effective learning tool. And how can it help you? Just ask it. Don't go anywhere because I want to tell you about Brilliant.org, the sponsor of this video. If you're interested in learning STEM subjects, then I think you're going to love Brilliant. Brilliant is an interactive learning platform. And it's that interactivity that really makes it stand out. Let me show you. So this is their scientific thinking course. And what makes it so effective, and this is the case for all of their courses, is this interactive element. The problems are designed to make you think about a topic in a way that deepens your understanding. Learning isn't just about receiving information. It's about engaging with that new information in a way that builds understanding. And that's what Brilliance Interactivity helps you achieve, which is why it's the best choice for learning math science and computer science. They have thousands of lessons going from the basics to advanced with new ones added each month. That feeling when you understand a topic that previously made no sense, you get a lot of that with Brilliant. If you want to experience it yourself, go to brilliant.org forward slash Python programmer or just click on the link in the description. And the first 200 of you will get 20% off Brilliant's annual premium subscription.